my name is Latif Free, and I'm doing a Black History Report on Booker T. Washington. Booker T. Washington was one of the most famous black leaders in America in the early 19th and 20th centuries. Booker T. Washington was born on April 5, 1856 to, to a slave named Jane. And, and a white man, and a white man he didn't know. After the Civil War, he and his mother moved to West Virginia, where she married a a free man named Washington Ferguson. In eight in eighteen seventy two, he walked five hundred miles to Hampton Normal Agricultural. Institute in Virginia where he attended school. In 1875 he graduated from Hampton University. He he was a school teacher and also attend, attended Wayland Cemetery in Washington DC. He got a job at, at Hampton and in 1881 he started Tuskegee University in 1895. In his speech, Atlanta com compromised. He said he said that black people should should accept social social and poli political injustice as long as we we have econ economic growth, education, and justice in the. In the in the legal system. Washington's suggestion started started a verbal battle between him and W.E.B. The boy. The boy. The boy. The boy. The boy, the boy was often offended that, that Washington thought black people didn't need to, to be tra treated equal, equally and that Washington did, did not Opposed Jim Crow. Booker T. Washington was the was the first black person to be invited to the White House. He was the first black person to to receive an honor an honorary degree degree from from Harvard. He was the first black per person on on the postage stamp. He even had his face on on a US half dollar. He was he was marked. He was he was married three times and had three children. He died in nineteen fifteen at at fifty nine of heart fail failure. We we have a high school in Atlanta named named after him.